The global space community converged in Sydney on Monday as the International Astronautical Congress 2025 officially kicked off. During the opening ceremony, China's Chang'e 6 mission was presented the World Space Award in the team category. The International Astronautical Federation's highest honor for exceptional contributions. The award recognized the mission's unprecedented achievement, the world's first ever sample return from the far side of the moon. Mr. Hu Hao, chief designer of the Chang'e 6 mission, accepted the honor on behalf of the team. We appreciate the international recognition of the Chang'e 6 mission. Advancing human well-being is our shared vision. Through the development of space technology, we hope to work hand in hand to create a brighter future for all. In accepting the award, who highlighted why this project resonated strongly with the international community. The Chang'e 6 mission marks the scientific precedent of retrieving far side samples, which is vital for global lunar research. Meanwhile, the wide acknowledgement of our commitment to international cooperation, including the four international payloads, and third, the exceptional performance of our team in completing such a complex mission. Beyond the engineering feat, the Chang'e 6 mission also explored a broad landscape of international cooperation, carrying four international payloads on board. Dr. Rahan Mahmoud contributed to the payload from Pakistan. And I'm very much excited that the Chang'e 6 got that award of IAF this year. And it is a very excitement moment that both of the countries put their effort and put one of a lunar cube set in the orbit IQQ. I believe that in future a lot of collaborations will continue between uh, China and Pakistan. It was amazing to be at the opening ceremony and see that the Chang'e 6 mission was awarded. The collaboration that China has been offering is amazing, uh, particularly to countries like South Africa. Uh, my organization uh, our payload is going with the Chang'e 8 mission. It was announced in April this year. Um, it's a wonderful opportunity for us that we would not achieve without collaboration, and we're very proud to be a part of it. Both near and far side lunar samples brought back from China's missions are also exhibited at the event. These unique samples are resulting in major scientific breakthroughs, unlocking the mysteries of the far side of the moon. This mission and this award underscores the sophisticated capabilities of China's lunar program and its commitment to contribute to humanity's shared knowledge. Qinglin CGTN, Sydney, Australia.